Okay, this is an update video. Um, I know I haven't released one in probably about a week or so. I've just been doing the diet and uh, still haven't really got off my butt and got out and walked yet uh, for more exercise. So I really need to get in gear to do that. And uh, just kind of been dealing with some depression lately. So, I don't know, I haven't really been motivated to release a vlog in a little while. I uh, figured releasing more, you know, here's what I eat type videos, it's like pretty much the same thing anyway. And uh, also just like creatively trying to think of, uh, of things to put, um, to put on video. It's a little bit rough sometimes, you know. It's like you see all these people doing all this content and releasing it on YouTube all the time. And it's just like, I don't know how they do it. There's just always well, something I guess to do, I guess depending on uh, what it is that they're doing. But uh, my life's pretty darn boring. So, you know, makes it kind of hard. There isn't really much else to do. It's just a daily thing. So... Um, I've been putting out applications online trying to find some um, like tech service support jobs with game servers etc. Um, something that I can do from here since I don't really have um, readily available transportation be a lot easier if I could do something from home. And uh, that's about it. I know in my first video I was like, oh, well, if I get a job, whatever, I could fall back on my bad habits. The thing is, it's like, you know, things that I'm doing here, like, if it takes off, awesome. If it doesn't, then, you know, it's whatever. But in the meantime, in order for me to actually do some of the things I wanted to do for content, because I'm also a gamer, um, I've also been wanting to do some of that, but I need to upgrade my hardware so that I can actually make decent quality videos. Right now, just using my cell phone isn't really going to, you know, make for high quality videos. Um, also, um, I like to stream, but again, that's another hardware issue. My CPU is really not all that great for that. It's kind of old at this point, so I need to upgrade that. And it'll also be a lot easier, too, for video editing, etc., and make it a lot easier to get content out and try to improve the quality and get things better, um, especially with, like, the audio right now. It's just on the cell phone. Um, when I tried using my headset with OBS, that didn't work out so good on the first video. It was uh, more messed up sounding than it, than it does just through being recorded on my phone. So, yeah. So I've been scouring the net the last few days. Um, some of the places you don't even really see. Uh, job opportunities, and if they do, some of them are, you know, on site, some of them aren't. So that's kind of a new thing I've never even really looked into because a friend of mine was telling me about uh, her daughter's boyfriend got a job just recently doing that, and I was like, well, dang, I, I'd gone to these types of sites and stuff and looked over things. You know, we have a couple of games that we have that are server hosted. and I never even thought to even look to see if they even had jobs for that stuff. So, you know. So, anyways. That's what I've been trying to do lately. Still sticking to the diet. Still think I'm losing weight. I'm going to be working on getting a scale pretty soon here. Um, I've just been looking around, scouring, because I don't want to buy a super, super expensive scale. Um, just need something that's going to be decently accurate is all so I can track it weekly that way I can actually put 
you know, a vlog up on that weekly with a weight update. So I know exactly where I'm going if I need to make tweaks to the diet or whatever because Atkins long term, it isn't really, you know, from reading and talking to other people, it's not really meant for like the use that I'm doing. It's good if you need to lose like 30 to 50 pounds or something because you can generally drop that relatively fast going on Atkins and then you can, then you can wean yourself off of it and then just, you know, control your, your food from there. Whereas I'm trying to lose, you know, 200 plus pounds, you know, 200 to 225 or so pounds. That means you got to be on, on a low carb diet a lot longer and you have the effect of, of trying to eat your muscles too. So I've been trying to figure out how to get the diet balanced so that I don't lose muscle mass. I know some of it's inevitably going to happen, but um, same thing even happens with that gastro bypass. Uh, your, your body will readily break down your muscles for energy because your body can break them down real easy for, for fuel. And it's unfortunate, but that's part of the thing too. So I just need to get out and be more physical. And, uh, yeah, I wanted to take the, the camera along, but I know just from doing handheld shots with it, it would be terrible. Like, it'd be so shaky, nobody would want to watch the video. It'd probably be like a roller coaster and probably make people get sick, like physically sick. So, um, I don't think I'd be able to really shoot any, any footage like that with my phone. So... Anyways, that's just kind of an update of what's been going on and what I, what I, what I want to do, what I'm trying to do. Um, try to figure out how to tweak the diet so that uh, I can minimize muscle mass loss because when I was going to the gym last year, I was trying to put muscle on. I wasn't able to put any, any significant amounts of muscle on and I think my diet was just not right. Um, I probably needed to be eating more food than I was like more specific things, um, the, you know, when you eat your carbs and all that kind of stuff, you know, it all makes a huge difference on when you're trying to put muscle on as well as doing cardio, uh, which, were, which was what I was doing. Um, I'd spend upwards of an hour and a half to two hours in the gym. Once I started going like full time, I was going five days a week and took the weekdays off. And... I didn't see any significant, like, change in my, the fit of my clothes or anything like that. Um, I, I didn't have a scale to weigh myself, so if anything, I'd probably put weight on from packing some, uh, some muscle on, but not, not anything significant. This seems to be the only thing for me that's worked, and I've gone, I've gone through pills, I mean, they've put me on strict diet plans that I've done while going to the gym and this seems to be the only thing that that works and I'm not exactly sure why I'd like to get some more blood tests with the doctor done to see if there's some something going on with my metabolism if it's just completely trashed or what and how to go about fixing that because I think my metabolism is is, is not right and it's not a thyroid thing. I got, I've gotten that checked numerous times. I don't have diabetes, so it's like nothing like that. I just don't think my metabolism is is because of the way I used to eat. I used to eat one or two big meals a day. I think it like murdered my metabolism off. So now I've been trying to eat at least three meals a day, but I want to start including snacks in there too, um, so that I'm having, you know five or six, like three meals and then like three snacks or something like that. So I'm having, you know, something for the metabolism to ramp up on throughout the day. I don't know how well that's going to work, but I think I'm going to give that a shot pretty soon here. Um, I just ate breakfast a little bit ago. I had two scrambled eggs with, uh, with uh, some cheese. And I'm actually already feeling hungry again. So and I, I, I did... 
I just ate breakfast like an hour ago. So I think the two eggs probably just wasn't enough. But I think what I'll do is I'll just try to grab something in there as a snack um, before lunch and see how that goes. Anyways, guys, I'm going to get out of here because um, I'm just going to probably start rambling and repeating myself over and over again because uh, I'll tend to do that. So, anyways, um, uh, give me a subscription, uh, like, dislike, uh, leave comments below, you know, some advice, anything here. Like I said, I want to try to make this a community for everyone to kind of like that's doing this. I've already had. Uh, quite a few re responses from from people just from the first few videos that I put out so I really appreciate you know everyone checking it out and uh, you know giving me a uh, positive energy for for you know succeeding in this endeavor because it's not going to be easy it's never been easy I'm fully aware of that I've failed many many times learned from previous failures and this time I just kind of did my own thing without the doctors really and we're going to see how this goes but for me my journey is probably going to be at least a couple of years or so I don't really want to lose the weight super super fast I've noticed that when weight loss goes off really quick because I've done it in the past I've gained it back and then some right after losing 50 pounds at one point um, I just don't want to do that so yeah anyways and I already said the like, subscribe, and all that stuff. But anyways, that's what happens when, when I get a thought after that. But anyways, see you guys next time.